Hi, it's Kip K from Make Magazine with a special Halloween edition of the Weekend Projects. The good old pumpkin, first associated with the harvest season and now commonly carved out into decorative lanterns as an emblem for Halloween. It first got its name Jack-O-Lantern because of the phenomena of strange flickering lights over peat bogs. Well, today we're going to take that tradition one step further as we combine a Larson scanner and some LEDs and turn this pumpkin into a Cylon jack-o'-lantern. You can find the Cylon jack-o'-lantern in the Make Halloween Edition on page 60 from the folks at Evil Mad Scientist Laboratories. The first step is to acquire all the components needed to build the Larson scanner, and that list is included with the PDF for this video. This component is named the Larson scanner after producer and writer Glenn Larson, who brought to the screen Battlestar Galactica and Knight Rider and loved using lights that scanned back and forth. So we'll be using the Larson scanner as the eye of the Cylon, just like in Battlestar Galactica. The finished component works great, and the speed of the scanning can be controlled by the potentiometer. Then it's time to design the pumpkin. I've seen so many Cylon jack-o'-lanterns that were basically just carved out, and I decided that since the Cylons are often referred to as walking chrome toasters, that I would use some chrome paint and paint my pumpkin, and then paint the outline of the Cylon helmet. You'll probably want to put the scanner in a Ziploc bag because of the moisture inside the pumpkin. Install it in the eye port of the pumpkin. And this is the completed Cylon Jack-O-Lantern. The Cylon Jack-O-Lantern is pretty impressive at night. And I found that a fully charged 9-volt battery will make the eye scan for a good 8 hours. So that's how to make a Battlestar Galactica Cylon Jack-O-Lantern. <laughs> 